In part 3 of this series, we will continue with Spring Data JPA. Today, we will take a closer look at the one-to-many relationship between two entity classes. We are going to extend our project with a new entity class book and create a relationship between member and book. As usual, we prepared a number of classes in Eclipse. First, we created a new entity class, book, with the usual annotations, entity, table, and the Lombok annotations. Furthermore, we have the following fields, ID, book name, and created at. The most important one here is the member field with the annotation many to one and the join column annotation. The many to one means multiple books for one member. Also note the fetch type, this is set to lazy. Then we modified the member entity class. Here we have the list books with the annotation one to many. Here this means one member with multiple books. Also here is the fetch type, set to lazy. Also note the builder default annotation above books. In addition, we have a method to add one book and one to delete a book. Then a new book repository interface with a custom method. We will use it to load a list of books that have a relationship with a member. We need this method because in both member and book we have the fetch type set as lazy. If you always want to load the books when you load a member, and if you want to load the member when you load the books, then you can set the fetch type to eager. Lastly, we modified the command line runner. First, we create an address and a member. Then, we create three books which we add with that book to our member. Then, we do a save from the member repository. Last we read all the data from our database with the member repository and then with the book repository. We can now start the project to see the results in the console. After we start our project, we can view the results in the console. First we save an address, then a member, and then save the three books. Then we load the member, and the books and print everything to the console. And finally we load the books with the member for each book and print everything to the console. So, this was it for today. Next time we will cover the many-to-many -many relationship between two tables. Thank you. Like, comment, share, and subscribe.